our firefighters were in the gym, they were working out, they heard the doorbell ring, not something that always happens for us. The woman at the door didn't share her name, but told firefighters she was a friend of the child's mother. She said the mother was unable to care for the baby and asked her to take him to the fire station under the Safe Baby Haven law. Under that law, parents can give up a newborn younger than 72 hours old. They worked uh, quickly to evaluate the child and make sure there weren't any immediate uh, medical needs. They found the child to be in good health. Despite this option, too often some babies are still abandoned. In 2016, a mother left this newborn in a Mesa neighborhood. And in 2017, this little girl was left in a backpack in Tempe. Both were found within walking distance from fire stations. So to have today's outcome is a relief for fire crews. In today's case, this was the right choice because they were in that position where they were feeling these emotions that they, they were uh, not able to give the appropriate care for this child. They realized that and they sought out the resources. So we're very thankful that today the, the system worked as it was designed. Now already this year in Arizona, there have been three infants turned in under the safe haven law. That's a pretty high number and to put it into perspective, there had only been three between 2015 and 2018. Lauren Reimer for Arizona's Family.